While the gas station is in a busy spot on Coors, the scene near Unser is in a neighborhood. This morning, folks who live in that area woke up to gunshots and then chaos as law enforcement officers swarmed the neighborhood. Alika Medina was out there and is in our newsroom now with more details here. Alika, you spoke with someone who saw all of it go down. Yeah, Tommy, Donald Gurule says it was a scary moment for him and his fiance. They were beginning an otherwise normal Sunday morning when police swarmed their neighborhood. I went to pick up my fiance from her house this morning and I was getting something out of the back of the trunk. Donald Gurule had to get video of what he saw unfold in the Anderson Mesa neighborhood this morning around 7.45. Uh, heard police sirens and heard tires screeching uh, and then I heard shots ring out in the neighborhood. Gurule says he saw four or five law enforcement cars rush into the neighborhood. And the cops were up and down the neighborhood trying to catch him, uh, finally pinned him down uh, by the entrance of the neighborhood. Uh, some more shots rang out. Gurule says in a matter of minutes deputies caught a man they say is Jeremy Smith, accused of killing a New Mexico State Police officer and suspected of killing a paramedic in South Carolina. Gurule says he felt uneasy knowing Smith must have been just a couple of houses away. It's scary. It, it makes me nervous that somebody like that was here, that they came from somewhere else and were able to get all the way to Albuquerque. Uh, so that makes me scared and nervous. Something else could have happened. He could have seen me outside and wanted to come and take my car to get away uh, and murdered me for my vehicle. Gurule swore Smith somehow got behind the wheel of a black truck during the chase, something the sheriff's office couldn't confirm. Either way, he says he can now breathe a sigh of relief. So I'm glad they got him. I'm glad they got him before anything else worse happened. Tommy, Donald Gurule is probably not the only person out there breathing easier tonight. Back to you. All right, thank you, Alika. As we first reported Friday, Jeremy Smith is a person of interest in the killing of a South Carolina paramedic. Phoenicia Machado Foray was last seen Tuesday at her home in Marion County, South Carolina. Her family first reported her missing Thursday and her body was found Friday evening. Smith was driving her white BMW the morning investigators say that he shot and killed Officer Justin Hare here in New Mexico. That was the car with the flat tires that we showed you Friday. Officer Hare was responding for a welfare check in that incident. The Marion County Sheriff posted this statement today saying in part, I speak for many here in Marion County when I tell you that I'm overwhelmed with relief knowing that Jeremy Smith is in custody. Our hearts are not only heavy for our own loss here in the PD region, but for the loss of New Mexico State Police Officer Justin Hare. Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham issued a statement as well, saying in part, today's capture and arrest of a suspect in the cold-blooded murder of State Police Officer Justin Hare is a major step toward justice for Officer Hare's family. While it doesn't bring Officer Hare back, it allows all New Mexicans to breathe a sigh of relief that a dangerous fugitive is off our streets. There are still a lot of questions involving the suspects. We will continue to follow any developments in this investigation and on this story. We'll bring you the latest here on KOB4 and on KOB.com.